This is definitely shaping up to be my favorite hike I've ever done. <laughs> In case you guys haven't noticed by the footage yet, I'm super excited because today I'm hiking Crypt Lake. Uh, it's gonna be a lot of footage of me today because unfortunately Elena didn't want to join. Something about holding on to the chain at the side of a mountain next to a 600 foot drop didn't appeal to her, so I'm doing this on my own, but uh, it's an 8K hike up to the lake. The lake itself, I'm not sure how high up it is, but it's a mountain lake. Apparently it just thawed like a week or two ago, so that'll be cold. It's supposed to be a hot day today, I think close to 30 degrees, so maybe I'll take a dip in there. <laughs> For the record, this is Crypt Lake in Waterton Lakes National Park. Keep forgetting to mention what park I'm in each day. <laughs> oh, so pumped, guys. I've been waiting for this for so long. So right now we're in a valley between two of the mountains up until Burnt Rock Falls, I believe he said it was called. It's like the easiest part of the hike. We're in shade right now, it's like pretty blush forest. But uh, the switchbacks are gonna get a little toasty. I'm like in the lead of the pack of hikers. So I feel like I'm leading a bit of a army of hikers in the forest. So we are now at Burnt Rock Falls, right behind us. So this is the end of the nice shady bits. And now we're on to the switchbacks in the open sun. So the, uh, the lake wait. at the top's yeah, already yeah, seeming pretty, <laughs> pretty enjoyable right now. <laughs> Sorry guys, I lied. That giant thing is Burnt Rock Falls. That other one was a pansy waterfall in comparison. I think it's massive. I think it's like 600 feet, he said. Something like that. So now the tougher part's really beginning. So across from us right now is the uh, well-known cave over there, a tunnel. And you can see there's a little semblance of a trail there. Here we go, into the tunnel. Hennersley clan, this part's for you. Here's the uh, the chain that you guys have been talking about. <laughs> and this is what it looks like next to it. It's not that bad. I can still hold a camera and be comfortable. We made it through the chain. It's actually not that bad. The chain's kind of in an inconvenient place. It's a bit better to use like a rock to post up on. And that is a gorgeous view. This is definitely shaping up to be my favorite hike I've ever done. Oh, we are coming up to where the waterfall starts. Oh, so pumped for this. What? We've been seeing this all along the trail. We have made it to the reward at the end of the hike. And what a reward. Check this out, guys. A 
greedy me wants to hike way up there somewhere and get a sweet view of this. And also, Lana's not around, so she doesn't have to worry about me because she doesn't even know I'm doing this. Ooh, feel it in the thighs. Still climbing. Still climbing. Well, heart's beating. I got way up here. Don't really feel like walking down. It looks to be a pretty good alternative right there, though. All right. Never thought I'd be tobogganing in July, but here it goes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Woo! oh my God, that was amazing. <laughs> it totally started accidentally. Woo, that'll cool you down. Damn. There's literally still floating ice on this lake. But I mean, I'm up here. I hiked this far, I got this hot and sweaty. I'm gonna jump in. Ooh, gotta psych myself up a little bit first. Oh <laughs> god! <laughs> Well, that was properly refreshing. Heading back down the mountain now. Hopefully have a bit of time to spare and check out that other waterfall. But, oh, it's nice. Nice being cool. And it will probably be pretty nice on these switchbacks down. <laughs> Well, we made it back to the boat. What year is it? Woo! <laughs> oh. That feels so good. <laughs> that guy did Crip Lake with his dog. He had to like lift his dog up the ladder. Had to get by the, the steel cable with a dog. I have a lot of respect for both the dog and the owner. I'm just hanging out at the harbor now, waiting for Alana. I was supposed to catch the 5.30 shuttle, but we just completely killed it on the way down the mountain. So we climbed the mountain in, I think it was two hours and a half, probably spent an hour up there, and then I think it was an hour and a half on the way back down. Uh, it was a ton of blast. <laughs> it was a blast, it was a ton of fun. Super wiped though, we did the whole thing, which ended up being 20k because we went around the lake and we were playing around there and stuff, which was a ton of fun. Uh, and we did that in about six hours. We didn't really take any breaks aside from the lunch at the top, so definitely pushed myself a little bit. But Cal, the guy that I was hiking with that I met on the trail, he's super cool. He's working for a company called uh, Backroads, I think it is, and basically they do camping tours for people so it's his first year working there but he had a day off so he came hiking he's done like a half marathon and stuff before so he definitely has more trail legs than i do and so i was just keeping up with him and that was a ton of fun after the crypt lake hike i completely forgot to film anything more i met up with lana and we were both pretty dead after our separate days so we kind of chilled out on the beach and uh, sat near the water and didn't really get up to too much. No, we just relaxed, uh, made some chili for dinner, which was really good. Man, it was, it was a nice night. I just happened to forget to film it, so in case you can't tell, it's the next day. But I'm going to end this vlog here because i got to start a new one today. It's a whole new day. It's a whole new day. Subscribe for more road trip action. We will see you tomorrow in the next episode. And then we will travel to the United States. <laughs> that was so good. Okay, bye guys. Bye.